Okay, I'm back, and it's like we never left. So what the hell were we doing? Find a way to kill and disgrace Shen. How? You're in a hurry to make enemies, aren't you? Very well. Master Shin has a new attendant in his entourage who's supposed to be trained. Attendant Keton. So just kill him. She is replacing one of the acolytes who did not return from Tian's landing. There was no explanation. I assume he was weak and was discarded. All right, you can find him. her and all of the other attendants by the doors to the inner chambers. They wait there for when Shin leaves to inspect new slave shipments. Okay. I'll say this. If you are going to try and fight them, hold nothing back. They will be trying to kill you. I've got a stick and it's on very easy. No, it's not on very easy. I've forgotten. And I've got a stick. So, you are the new trainer. You think you have something to show us? Master Shin has us test each of Gong's trainers to make sure they are skilled. But not too skilled. <laughs> am I your next student? I assure you, I am more than capable of defending myself. I was made an attendant because of my skills. <sighs> I love talking to NPCs. <clears throat> You'd better be competent. If not, you might have an accident. Is that so? I would be more concerned about yourself if I were you. Let's move this fight to the Hall of Induction so I have room to enjoy this. Watch as she instantly kicks my ass like every other fucking character. Yeah, she's got poison. Oh wait, I get to bring my back up. Oh, you're dead. You're dead, love. Did I just kill her? Am I uneasy? I'm not uneasy. I'm on just tough enough. Just tough enough. Matt, I really enjoyed Punch Post Mod Jukebox yesterday. I thought that was fantastic. In fact, you could say it was pretty tasty. You are either brave or foolish. I warned you that appearing too strong would make you a target of Shin's attendants. Actually killing one will incite them further. Well, there was no... I would be very careful if you intend on continuing to train the others. They will not let the death of Keton go unanswered. Three more to go and Shin is helpless if called to fight. What? That is your plan? I wish you luck, but I'm staying well out of the way. This is going to get really ugly. Your next student has been chosen for you. I did warn you that appearing too strong would put you in danger. Oh, beware this next attendant. It didn't attendant give me an Kai option. Feng is waiting for you with his remaining fellows at the doors to the inner chambers. It didn't give me an option, so we're just going to hit everyone. We're just going to hit everyone with our stick. He'll get burlier, they'll get burly. Eventually they'll get too burly and I'll turn the difficulty down. Because fuck that shit, man. I mean, this is going to be a long LP. This is a short game, but because I'm trying to do everything I can. And I'm playing it blind. Um, lost. What do you want now? Ah, here they are. No, that's not them. Hmm. Okay. Not really sure. Even though I just did this. Oh 
Oh wait, they should just be over here, right? You... you killed Ketan. The life of an acolyte is forfeit when they walk into this place, yes. But for one of Gong's ragged minions to do this is unforgivable. This is gonna put a lot of discord in my heart, isn't it? Do you think you can make such an insult and disguise it as a simple training mishap? You are a fool. Well, I have a stick. If you are ready, trainer, your next student is waiting. It is my task to make examples of Gong's acolytes who show too much promise. I'm ready. Come, Kai Feng. Let us see how skilled you are. My skills are above question. Gong is about to lose another of his pitiful acolytes. Come, let's move to the hall, and I will end this. No one questions why I've got a second and he hasn't. You killed Kai Feng? But he was fully trained. Care to spar? Such insolence will not go unpunished. We'll make an example of you soon enough. Your corpse will be dragged before your master. But Kai Feng was a full assassin. How could he have fallen? Shut up. This fool will pay. You'll see. You'll regret this. If you both come at me at the same time, it might be a fair fight. This is Radinky Donkey Donkulus. That's better. Lotus Acolyte of Gong, we must make an example of you. You have insulted the attendants of Master Shin's entourage. The Masters do not care whether Acolytes live or die, so it is up to us to avenge the deaths of our. Oh, now enemies. it's fun! We will not appear weak. We are the attendants of Master Shin. You will die as penance for your insult. <laughs> you force my hand. Come, attendants. I will fight you all. Your death will be an example to all of Gong's fools. was an impressive display, Acolyte. I've never seen Shin's attendants so handily dismissed. I'd like you if you weren't so evil. Master Shin's enemies are probably very impressed with your actions. I can only speculate, of course. I do not like how he hides behind us, a coward in commander's robes. I'm sure we'll murk him eventually. Yes, Acolyte. I have some questions. Proceed. Why didn't you help? Have you not been paying attention? Ac yeah. I am sure. Right. I marvel at your ability. You show no fear of the enemies you make. You will do well here. Yes! You have no more acolytes to train for now. Is there anything else you need? Um... Why didn't you help me? As I believe I said, I have survived by not angering anyone and not appearing too skilled. I would have enjoyed killing them, but if you lost, I would have died too. But the bloodlust! That is the way of things here. Take care of yourself first. Risks bear penalties as well as rewards. But the bloodlust! It must be slaked. I have... Ah, you got nothing. Right. We need to start looking around a bit more. Yes. You already know enough of when he is. I am. Sh 
Because all we're doing is leveling this mook up. Dude, can we put him in the press? Doki yir, wo sai yir, Lucy, wo nika wo no you. He's not that stupid. Be careful, fool. One distraction and I could have been crushed. Wo no a yir, soon po now, pok nara wa yir look. When the jade golem is dumb, have a normal spirit shroud made and replace this clay golem. The ranks must be full when the jade golem is activated. My own demons distract me in this place, but I hold no love for your new master or the master above him. If you kill one, why not two? Distractions are the key to weakness in a target. If you look to the future, Master Gong will have his plans come crashing down on him. Um? Where did you go? Like, where did he go? He snuck up, whispered to me, and then fucked off. I'm not happy about that. I'm super not happy. So who's that there? That machine is massive. Who knew the assassins were constructing it in my father's tomb? Clearly not you, Queen Observant. A thought on golems. Until recently, very little was known about golems. Those few people skilled enough to craft golems keep their secrets carefully. Powerful and deadly foes, golems are feared throughout the Empire. Through their workings, though their, mer uh, though their workings remain a mystery, there are several useful characteristics worn worth noting about these formidable opponents. I'm tired, I'm sorry. These man-made beasts are immune to most types of magic. Their solid exterior is the best attack with equally strong forces. Weapons and strength are the best ways to defeat these dangerous adversaries. Ah! That hurts. Can I just push this guy over the edge? That'd be quite funny. And then murk his boss as well. So... You are the new Lotus Acolyte under Master Gong. No one else has reason to be here. He was quick to favor you. New recruits are typically held in isolation. I will instruct you on the use of the Golem Present Crane. Forming the Golems is an honored task that elevates us above slaves and mere servants. Right. Press is simple to use. Using this machine, we can create a legion of warrior Golems in a day. Right. Death's hand has great power. We need proof of this from the inner chambers. Our power must be growing at an incredible rate. This is only one step. Here we create husks devoid of energy. Each golem needs a spirit shard to move, and a jade golem must guide them all. Take out a green ones, right. For each shard, a spirit must be reduced to its essence. For a time, we use those that lingered near their graves, mining them as if they were silver. No longer. The recently dead make a stronger, more obedient golem, if the death is painful. With a jade golem guiding them, legions act as one, utterly obedient. Right. The extraction chamber is a far more interesting place to work. The screams over there are music. Here we have only the creaking of clay. Clay is fine. The machine looks dangerous. Have accidents claimed any lives? You nearly saw one as you entered, but they are rare. Falling victim to an obvious <sighs> danger like a dropped golem or worse, the press, would take a monumental fool. The machines are loud and you can see the operator from anywhere in the room. A past victim of the press suffered more damage after the incident than during it. Reputations are very important in the Lotus Assassin Order. <clears throat> Falling victim to the press would cause a loss in status almost fatal in and of itself. Time to go in the press, buddy. Tell me about them. The press is simple to operate. You select the type of body at the first station, 
Once the material is poured, it is funneled to the press. The press serves as a mold and a kiln. In short order, it can be opened and the new body is ready to be moved. The crane controls are at the end of the ramp. You can experiment with each station if you want, but you may as well reduce what you produce to rubble. There are no shards to power any more golems for now. You test my patience, Acolyte. And you test mine. Different golems. You do not need to know much. We can make husks right now, but there will be no more spirit shards until the jade golem is completed. Kill people? The average citizen of the Empire is worthless. They're nothing more than cattle. In this, they can at least serve some useful purpose. Dude. Okay. I will. I made a golem. How cool is that? Let's make another one. And then leave it there. Just in case we can manufacture a bit of murder. You never know. Yeah, I don't want to fight you guys. Uxier wa to afu ni ye froto uso so ye uktatas ye ni ryoki. I'm the protagonist. Acolyte. Master Shin would be disgraced if I killed if killed by the Golem Press. Hmm. An interesting idea. It has happened before, and the victim was certainly considered a fool for letting it occur. But it's impossible. You may as well try and drop one of the golems on him. He would never be so distracted as to enter the press. We are Lotus assassins, after all. Then I will kill him and put him in there possibility but Shin does not leave the inner chambers often only to inspect the new slave shipments arriving in the hall of induction <laughs> this is you evil. would have to close a great many eyes to get away with an assassination in the hall and moving the body to the press but it would certainly send a message the hall cleared of all witnesses the press operator distracted and the slave shipment stopped outside in the necropolis before it arrives a daunting list of tasks. Dude, that's insane. Do it quietly, but use force where you must. Succeed, and I will introduce you to Grand Inquisitor Gia in the inner chambers. A rare honor for an acolyte. Goodbye for now. Remember your tasks, acolyte. Create a spirit shard in the extraction chamber for the Jade Golem, and find a creative way to kill and disgrace Master Shin. I am... Right.
Remove all possible witnesses from the Hall of Induction. Convince them by guile or force. Convince the Locus Atter Acolyte operating the Golem Press to leave his station. Leave the Lotus Assassin Fortress to stop the slave shipment arriving from the Necropolis. Well, that should be our first task. As that's the furthest away. I like this. I'm being evil, but I'm not really being punished for it. That's not the door. There's a big old pile of damn bones. Ow! What? what? Is there a shipment of slaves, do you see? Yes. Master Shin will be inspecting them when they arrive, but there is no sign of them yet. Perhaps they were delayed in the necropolis. So somewhere in the necropolis there's a shipment of slaves that I've got to waylay. They'll just kill the guards and then um, free the slaves. Gravedigger Shen. Well, where are they? Ah, oh, here we go. You there! Stand aside, or risk the ire of the Lotus Assassins. These prisoners must be delivered to the fortress to be inspected by Master Shin. I will not allow you to make me late. I cannot allow this delivery to take place. And why is that? Keep your reason short, or you'll be dead before you're done. They will not be delivered. Abandon them or fall, slave driver. You are mad to test an assassin. I'll kill you where you stand. Staff! Are you taking us to the Lotus Assassins? Uh, no, you're free. What? Thank you. Thank you so much. I knew someone would stop them. Someone kind and honest. Be safe, now go. Let's hope letting them go does no harm to our cause. Thank you. Yes! Yes! Oh, I let some slaves go. But the joy of putting him in his own mold is going to be hilarious and horrific and fantabulous. I need to empty the hall. How do I empty the hall? They deserve to die. They all deserve to die. How does one empty the hall? Ah, are you the student I am waiting for? I can't delay any longer. I cannot miss the window of opportunity for a summoning. A what? As I was saying, golems are playthings, devoid of cunning. The latest stockpile stands idle, waiting for a jade golem to make them useful. The waste. 
I will show Grand Inquisitor Gia that tapping the spirit realm for servants is more efficient. Witness as I effortlessly summon an able minion from the void. Go wrong, go wrong. What preparations have you made? There are hardly any preparations needed, Acolyte. They want to serve. They tell me so. Golems want nothing. Watch and learn. He's gonna do my job for me. Ukir Sitaka Wuwir Wosayir Yuf Praun! No, no! This isn't right! Destroy them! I saw nothing of this. Nothing. I... I have to continue my research before Gia knows of my failure. Oh, I know it can work. That's a couple of dudes removed. And I didn't even have to do anything nasty. <laughs> Fucking... These Lotus guys are doing it for me. It's, it's nice. Um, what do you have for sale? Dire flame. I can't afford it. I compensated your effort with some silver. About a thousand silver. I would. I'm going to skip through your dialogue because you're not important. I, you know, honestly, you don't sell anything I care about. Uh, right. What do you want now? What could cause a machine as sophisticated as the press to break down? You are right to marvel at its stability. It is a machine in balance. Only errors of its operators have damaged it before. Several foolish acolytes were killed for damaging it. It's not so hard to use properly. All you do is work the crane and occasionally add phoenix oil to the material selector. The measure of oil has been wrong too often. Kia Jong gives it out too freely. I will see to it that your kind are only given pre-measured containers of it. Interesting. Where does it come from? Gong needs to better train his acolyte. Phoenix oil is a viscous liquid that burns at an incredible temperature. It heats the press to cure the golem husks. If there's too much in the machine, it burns too hot. Too little and the golems crumble. Um, I'm going to save it. And then I'm going to try and get rid of them. I'm not quite sure how I could possibly distract these two. But... That is unfortunate. Because the needs of an acolyte are of little concern. Our tasks are done for the day, but Grand Inquisitor Gia could request us at any time. God, you sound like a Must petulant be ready child. To respond What's wrong with the Golem Press? You normally do good voices. What's wrong with you? Nothing short of her order or an emergency repair will move us. Step away. You are right. Okay, so I can't get rid of you. to break the machine to get rid of them. Really? Really now? Can I not just bump them off? What do you want? The you are... Test my patience. That was not a request. We are not acolytes of your petty. Bah, gang wanted you move, but I'll just kill you. Yeah. You are. 
So staff. I can't be bothered. I'm not sure what I was, how I was supposed to get them out of the hall, but uh, in the long run, I don't think it's going to affect my. Uh... No, I need to go. Yeah, it's going to affect my rating too much. As long as I keep trying to do good. Uh, muddying the waters a bit here, but expediency is the name of the game. This way. Map. Oops. Yeah, this one. I need to relieve you at this post. You must leave the room. Is that so? Why should I step aside for a new blood acolyte? I have my own position to think about and I will not be so easily replaced. If you bring an order from Master Ga... Your position depends on Master Gangs. I can raise him if there are no prying eyes. Master Gang would rather not be... Uh. I see. The ways of the Order are mysterious and brutal. If an opening is created away from witnesses, all of us under him will benefit. I understand. See, I'm new here, so I'm doing I will dirty to the golems that are being readied for the Jade Golem's command. I do not think I will be able to return to this room today. But a thought occurs to me. If one opening raises us all, two openings will raise us further. If something were to befall the good master, uh -huh. just something you might want to ponder. I see what you mean. Right. I'm good. I'm a hero. <laughs> um, kill Master Shin. Where is the soul extraction chamber? Right, is that here? Nope. How about over here? You approach the soul extractor. The assassins want you to create a spirit shard, to crush a life to power a golem puppet. They are very efficient in their brutality now. Hmm. It wasn't always like this. Fear used to be the primary tactic. Destroy the family of one to ensure the loyalty of all. It caused chaos, uprisings, close allies turning on each other. Those inclined to betrayal fear it the most. Imagine if you could corrupt the machine and return the chaos of disloyalty the Emperor dreads. Can I ruin their plans and get what I need? No matter your motives, helping the assassins harms you. If you corrupt the spirit shard, you can move forward while also crippling their golems. Good idea. They seek control. There used to be a chance to disobey when the order given was too harsh. The victim's pointlessly innocent. Now there is only obedience. There is something chaotic enough to disrupt that. In the elevator room to come, descend to the deepest mine, to the oldest graves. 